given to devil discuss about segments and intervals of ecg now what is the difference between segment and interval segment it is a straight line connecting two ways and interval that is one way plus connecting straight line now let us start with pr segment you can see here in this diagram this is pr segment it is an isoelectric period following p wave and duration of pr segment that is 0.04 second it is the period of conduction pause at ab node next is st segment it is isoelectric period extends from the end of s wave to the beginning of t wave you can see here in the diagram this is st segment this one it measures the time from the end of ventricular depolarization to the onset of ventricular repolarization and its duration is 0.04 to 0.08 second st segment is elevated in the patients with myocardial infarction next is tp segment it is the period from the end of t wave to the beginning of p wave of next cardiac cycle you can see here in this diagram end of t wave here beginning of p wave here this is tp segment Duration of TP segment is 0.2 seconds and it is inversely related to the heart rate. In AV dissociation, TP segment is variable. Next is PP interval. It is the interval between two P waves and equal intervals indicates rhythmic depolarization of atria. Next is PR interval. It is the interval between onset of P wave and onset of QRS complex. actually between p wave and the q wave but q wave is absent and therefore it is known as pr interval you can see here in this diagram this is pr interval this one pr interval represents atrial depolarization plus ab conduction and its duration is 0.12 to 0.16 second it decreases with increase in the heart rate when the duration is more than 0.2 seconds it indicates delayed conduction and conduction block and when the duration is less than 0.12 second it indicates impulses may arise from av node next is qt interval it is the interval from onset of q wave to the end of t wave you can see here qt onset of q wave to the end of t wave here this one it denotes systolic time of the ventricle that is ventricular depolarization and repolarization and duration is 0.4 seconds clinical significance of qt interval that is qt interval is prolonged in ischemia ventricular conduction defects and hypokalemia next is st interval you can see here in this diagram this is st interval this one that is interval between end of s wave to the end of t wave normal duration of st interval that is 0.32 seconds and it corresponds with ventricular repolarization there is also j point you can see here in this diagram j point here it is actually here it is a point with the end of s wave and start of st segment and it coincide with end of depolarization and onset of repolarization of the ventricle and it is the point of no electrical activity all parts of the ventricles they are depolarized and therefore no current is flowing around the heart and it is important to assess st segment elevation or depression so this is all about segments and intervals of ecg thank you